this is just a demonstration of uh, adding your Nest thermostat or your smart home devices to your Raspberry Pi Google Assistant. So this is my Raspberry Pi here. Uh, this is Raspberry Pi 3 with 1 GB, 1 GB RAM. So I put heatsink on both sides of the CPU as well as on GPU and put a fan on top to cool down. So I have to set up uh, all ev everything once I have done in a pretty neat box. So I'm planning to build a magic mirror. So yeah, so this is a breakout panel to my breadboard so I can do my circuits here, uh, switch and LED lights or whatever you want. And these are just uh, old speakers that I cracked out of my old computer. And this is basically amplifier and stuff. You can connect any 3.5 jack speaker to this setup. Uh, it got a 3.5 jack here. Uh, yeah. So to control your Nest thermostat or your smart home device, you need application called IFTT. Uh, you can download it from Google Play Store. Just search for IFTTT. There is 3T. And this is it. So I have already downloaded. So click open. And to set it up, you got to go to applets. And I have created some. Uh, this is for my TP Link Smart Plex and I have, yeah you can you can do pretty much anything with this uh, application connected to google assistant and other service this is like a bridge acting between these services so you get to create a new one so this is basically i f t t t so you get to uh, set up your google assistant here click this and search for google assistant it's here yeah so you got options to for kind of commands you can simply say phrase and to trigger an event or you can say phrase with a number or you can say phrase with a text ingredient or both text and number so for nest like thing you got to uh, select say a phrase with a number so because you need temperature so what you want to say uh, set my uh, thermostat to 72 degree so instead of 72 degree put a pound sign there so you can configure different setup here like uh, uh, set 70 degree on my thermostat so that's it and you can say you, you can um, you will be getting response from assistant like uh, setting up setting up thermo stat to 70 degree Um, sorry for that. It hi. is oh, okay. Hi. Uh, it's just a greeting from the Google Assistant. So next thing, we need to connect what our service we want. So right here, we need Nest to perform our things. So search for Nest. So here it is. Sorry for the video. Uh, I'm just recording the video from another phone so you can see set temperature temperature range and stuff so first time if you are performing the action you will be asked to connect your IFTT application to the nest so just sign in and it's pretty easy and here we are performing set temperature so I have to thermostat uh, you can select which device you want to control this bedroom temperature uh, bedroom thermostat as well as family so right now i want to control bedroom so here you got to
with your temperature instead of putting a number you can add ingredient number field because we are sending the request from google assistant as a, a pound sign it is a number field so that's it oh it's in fahrenheit just that um, you can get notification on your phone so it's basically the recipe if you say set my thermostat to 70 degree then set temperature of bedroom thermostat that's it hit finish yeah you're ready to go so right now my temperatures are 70 degree in my bedroom so we, we are gonna set it to 72 hey google set my thermostat to 72 setting up thermostat to 72 boom let's change to 72 that's it um uh, we can send it to water like hey google set my thermostat to 68 setting up thermostat to 68 that's it 68 so I'm gonna go back to 70. Hey Google, set my thermostat to 70. Setting up thermostat to 70. Yep, kaboom, that's it. So you can pretty much uh, do anything with IFFT application with your custom built Google Assistant on Raspberry Pi or other devices. Uh, so in my setup, I have used Gasit Pi from GitHub. I will leave the link below and that's it i'll be back with more videos i want to build a magic mirror combined with google assistant so i'll be posting more videos uh, click like and subscribe if you like and thank you have a good day